and I'm back. So a lot of you have been commenting that I missed some stuff because I didn't watch episode 5.5. And I was like, oh my god, 5.5 was a thing? I did a bit of digging around and apparently it's like this whole separate thing. So I don't know how I missed it, but uh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna take some time to watch episode 5.5 today. It's gonna be a throwback. So uh, hopefully my, my dumb ass can finally finally piece together some clues because apparently there were a lot hidden in this episode. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's just let's just play. Thanks for commenting on my videos by the way. Um, I'm really having a lot of fun just reading those and uh, getting to know you guys. So Bro, this guy's out of gas in like three steps. Come, okay, oh no, no, actually, you know what? This actually reminds me of a place in China. They had a like really long staircase. You know, in Vancouver, there's the mountain called the Grouse Grind, and um, man, it's just like steps. It's just steps all the way up. It's like two kilometers of steps, and man, does that hurt? So, I get this. Oh my God, was this guy bullied as a kid? Is this Xiaoling? Uh, Oh, sheesh. Sheesh. <laughs> I love that. I love that, actually. You know what? If if you get saved by a girl, just confess to her. Amen. Brother, my man's a real homie, bro. He he do be out here confessing. Oh, uh, dude, this, this OP is such a throwback, but unfortunately, I'm getting a lot of copyright recently. I don't know if that's an issue or not. But uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna skip this a bit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I'm gonna co get copyright off of that little little snippet. But whatever. I literally don't care. I'm just watching anime here. Oh, is this a, like a this is like a Street Fighter fighting game? Okay. Oh, sheesh! Look at that. I am it is fighting game. <laughs> Dude. You know Cheng Xiaoshi is a true gamer when he blames the lag. L okay, between Cheng Xiaoshi and Lu Guang, Lu Guang's definitely 1000% the better gamer. I'm calling it right now. Just kidding. No, he's he's dog. He's actually dog. <laughs> Chao Ling's actually like busted. <laughs> he doesn't hit girls. <laughs> what an excuse. Oh, oh my god, that's so funny. That's so funny. These guys are actually... They're such a good trio. Wow, look at this animation. Holy. This is like uncalled for animation. Oh, this is like a traditional martial arts kind of thing, yeah? Where like, oh, I'm gonna marry your daughter and then the father's like, no, no, no. To, to win, you must beat me in a fight. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. Okay. Bro, he could do without the screaming. I have a question for you guys. So if you guys were in this scenario, right? Let's say you just fell in love with this girl. And then, you know, this this girl's like a, like, you know, a, a daughter of a, like a martial arts expert. And you had to beat up that person. Like, would you, would you guys fight in order to, in order to like win this girl's? Uh, hand in marriage or whatever, you know? Toxic trait here, guys, but I can totally beat the master guy in a fight. Like, 1,000%. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Cut, 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 cut. Okay, so they're diving back in time. Oh, this is like a t typical f Polaroid photo. It's uh, it's a nice detail. You have to kind of shake it, I think, to get it, uh, it, uh, get it to print. Yeah, man's doesn't even have cardio enough to climb the stairs, man. You gotta, you, you gotta, you gotta boost the cardio so you guys can fight longer. You know, cardio is conditioning and cardio is very important in traditional mar uh, martial arts and martial uh, modern martial arts as well. Very important stuff. Damn, that's menacing. That's like a JoJo's reference. Surely, haven't watched JoJo's, but uh, you know how it is. Sheesh, what a declaration. Sheesh. No, 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 no. I like the balls on this guy. You know, you know what my coach said to me the other day? He was like, he was like, you know what? You might not have the physical capabilities, but at least you got the spirit. And I see it 
in this man too. He's he's got the spirit, you know. Physical abilities could use a bit of bit of work. Look at the couple things. Go die, normies. Holy. <laughs> Just stop this guy's. <laughs> Dude, he's adding his lines, bro. Oh, see. Uh, you know, this is a detail that I actually like didn't really realize. Is like one photo could only be used one time. Actually, didn't notice that. Dang. <laughs> this is how I climbed the grass grind too. Uh, it, trust me, I got gassed out in like three minutes flat. No cap for real. <laughs> Bro, man's out here just sleeping. He can't be just sleeping. This guy's like trying his best climbing the mountain up here and man's just taking a nap. Sheesh. Okay, so wa after watching season two, like, we know that these guys have fighting skills, like, surely. Wait. Chung Xiao is actually bad? Oh, maybe this is just before they train martial arts. This is interesting. Bro, Lu Guang's instructions. <laughs> Freestyling. He do be freestyling, wait. Oh no, no, no. He wait, Chung Xiao Shun knows his stuff. No, he's dude, he's literally he's literally dancing. Well what? Monkey steals peaches? Ooh, got hit with the right offer. Monkey steals peaches? Bro, what a dude, what was he trying to grab? What do you mean secret move? That's just a regular uppercut. Holy crap. Come on, guys. Ten years to learn an uppercut? Stop, stop. That's why it's it's all mental. The fight's all mental. Right? It it's not physical, it's mental. Oh, I like that. I like that. He finds the motivation within himself, right? Oh god, I couldn't really read that. I'm a fake Asian, fake Asian. But I love how he finds motivation within himself. He just feels like he needs to be stronger. And maybe, I think we should all just find that same motivation in our hearts, you know? Mm. Find what moves you. And despite the hardships, we just keep going. That was an incredibly cheesy line. Oh my god, it's the one punch man. Oof. They couldn't really see it because it's, uh, it was too fast. Darn. Oh my god, is, is this the boy? Is this? Oh, wow. Oh, after, now, after watching, after watching season two, we now know that it's their sensei, right? But this has to be this guy. Oh, wow. Okay. So, so the old folks are, are these people then? Wow. I, I see why you guys have been, have been commenting to just like, s basically screaming at me to watch episode 5.5. I, I, I see it now. Man's, man's climbing every single day. Oh man, this music hits hard too. Oh dang, they're all helping him up. They should really install like a ski lift or something, you know, to up this mountain. Honestly, and how do how did these guys get there? Oh, wait, they're still not married. They're like eighty, bro. Actually, I'm gonna stop talking. I, I think this is a very emotional scene. Oh, 
<laughs> no wonder he's collapsing. Like man has to climb a two hour like hike before before he fights like the master. Come on. Like to give him a fair fight, he should he should the master should climb the mountain first. Let's be honest. Man's fighting in the most exhausted state ever. She <laughs> look at these guys. They're so cheeky. Wait. I can't read! No subtitles? Not searching for unusual subject matter, but making commonplace unusual. Aww. Wait, that's so... Wow. Wait. I don't know if the song is... I don't care if the song is copyright, actually. I'm just gonna enjoy it. Wow, can I read that quote again real quick? Real quick, real quick. Please. Okay. Not searching for unusual subject matter, but making the commonplace unusual. That's such an interesting take. Wow. I actually, you know what? I'm not going to pretend I know what that means. Uh, but I, it hits me different, you know? <laughs> that's, <laughs> maybe that's a little ridiculous to say, but I'm not too sure what that means. Oh, sheesh. She's got a little smug look. I like that. I like that. She's, um... Oh, look at... Look at Cheng Xiaoshi's like, nice and smile. Lu Guang's just unhappy, as usual. Yay. Guys, what are what are your thoughts on what is the hardest thing about love? Leave, uh, leave them in the comments below so I know you made it this far. G guys, guys, guys. You have to tell me these songs, they hit different. I don't know, like, okay, to be totally honest, I've listened to, like, a couple Chinese songs, right? Like, especially back in the day. But, like, they all have this, like, same vibe, especially the emotional ones. But somehow, like, something about it just gets me different, you know? Oh, I love this shot. I love this shot. Wow. Wow. You know what? I I want to take a picture just like this, guys. Uh, if If you know anyone, hit me up. Oh, wait, this is the end? Oh, it's the end, unfortunately. Uh, wait, is there a little more? Nope, that's it. Okay. Wow, what a beautiful episode. Beautiful episode. Ah, this doesn't tell me anything about three-star warriors or whatever, but this does give um, a background on, like, their sensei. I, I wonder if they just trained thereafter in the dojo then. This is very interesting. Yeah. But um, let me know your thoughts. To answer the first question. The first question is... Um, people often ponder, what is the hardest thing about love? You guys tell me in the comment section below. I don't know. What is the hardest thing about love? For me, uh, it might be something along the lines of mm, communication. Communication, I feel like, is definitely important in a relationship. Although I'm not sure if that's the hardest or more import most important thing. But, um, hey, if you want to hear more about love, I'm considering doing an Oshinoko, like, sort of analysis slash reaction video. I don't know how that will go, but, uh, well, look forward to it. Actually, I have no idea. I'm not going to make any promises. All right. So, guys, um, hope you enjoyed me reacting to episode 5.5. 5. Uh, I know this has been on everybody's, uh, God, I, I can't get rid of the ads without pausing it. But, yeah, uh, I hope you, you know. Thanks, thanks, guys, for telling me to watch episode 5.5. Uh, hit um, season one, do be hitting in the fields. And yeah, wow. Such a great episode. All right. Uh, hopefully, as of now, I've recorded the first four reactions. Hopefully, that doesn't affect my reaction for f episode four of season two. I don't think it does. But uh, just in case, you know, um, I do apologize because I, I, I binged all four episodes at once. I think the next episode, episode 5 of season 2, is coming out in two days. Um, be sure to stick around because I will definitely be reacting to it. Uh, but other than that, yeah, um, 
What a throwback to season one. Maybe I'll get on the chibi shorts next. And I'll, I'll watch that on my own time. I don't know if they're short short or if, you know, uh, if something else. I have no idea what to expect. Might be a little like cute snippets here and there. All right. So that's about it. Uh, I'll see you later.